Now for our feature story of the day. Here's how Bitcoin reaches 2.9 million per coin, according to major asset management giant Vanek. That's right, family. Major massive bullish prediction coming from Van Eck here. Analysts at the investment management giant Van Eck think the Bitcoin price can skyrocket to 2.9 million per coin. But here's the kicker by 2050. So we got quite a while before that. <laughs> Just FYI. But for that to happen, Bitcoin will need to become a key part of the international monetary system. According to Matthew Siegel, Van Eck's head of digital asset research and Patrick Bush, senior investment analyst, at the firm, quoting him here, we expect Bitcoin to be widely used in international trade, becoming a significant medium of exchange and a valuable store of wealth. This leads to Gresham's law-like feedback loop. As Bitcoin becomes more useful and valuable, central banks and long-term investors will want to hold more Bitcoin, reducing the amount available in the floating supply. Siegel and Bush say it is conceivable that Bitcoin could be used to settle 10% of the globe's international trade and 5% of the world's domestic trade by 2050. Quoting them again, this scenario would result in central banks holding 2.5% of their assets in Bitcoin, using assumptions about global growth, investor Bitcoin demand, and Bitcoin's turnover, we apply a velocity of money equation to suggest a potential price of 2.5%. $9 million per Bitcoin, translating to a total market cap of $61 trillion. Now, the velocity of money measures the rate money is used to buy the goods and services in an economy. So there you have it. Van Eck, major asset management giant, $2.9 million by the year 2050. Personally, in 2050, Bitcoin could be $2 billion. Who knows? I'm just going to say it. We've already had Jurian Timmer of Fidelity come out, and he's the head of macro at Fidelity, projecting Bitcoin could hit $1 billion per coin. Why $1 billion? Hyperinflation. It's a possibility. Bitcoin has no top because fiat has no bottom. Realistically, will the U.S. dollar still be in existence in 20-something years? Probably not. Very low probability on that. So if the dollar is no longer here and it gets replaced with hypothetically speaking, a CBDC, in which our leaders promise us will never happen, then uh, anything is possible. Uh, Bitcoin, if the world is hyperinflated and a loaf of bread costs $10,000, who knows? Maybe Bitcoin will be hundreds of millions of dollars one day. You know what I mean? Now, at today's inflation and current, you know, situation, two and a half million Bitcoin, I can see that realistically happening within a couple of more cycles. I think this particular cycle, we peak out somewhere between 222,000 and 750, 750 being my bull scenario, 222 being my bear scenario. Then I think the following having in 2028 will spark the next epoch for Bitcoin to hit seven figures. So hypothetically speaking, let's just run with my conservative projection for this cycle at 250,000. Well, then I think next year we have the potential to 4X to a million per coin. And then the following having, heck, 2032, very realistic, multiple seven figures. So I would throw a timestamp on that of by 3033, I can see a $2.9 million Bitcoin very realistically. I don't think it has to take until 2050, but heck, there you have it. And that's my personal uh, projection of where we're likely to go from this particular having a where we're at to the following epoch and the following epoch, 2.9 million. It's inevitable, in my humble opinion. Bitcoin will continue to do what it does best. I mean, for Christ's sake, we're up over 64 million percent since its inception, uh, freaking uh, 15 years ago, since the Genesis block of January 3rd, 2009. Bitcoin's on a 15-year trajectory uh, of bullishness. If you look at the bigger picture, I'm a big picture type of guy. I'm always thinking about future having cycles where Bitcoin will likely to be. I can care less about the short-term price action. We just do it because it's fun, right? It's just fun to watch. But nonetheless, focus your eyes on the prize cycles down the road and become yourself a Bitcoin hodler for at least 10 years. Have at least a 10-year hodl strategy. That would be my advice teaching every one of you. Not financial investment advice, but just savings advice, just common sense. Treat your Bitcoin as a savings. Do not save in fiat. In fact, those who save in fiat currency, what do we call them, folk? People that use fiat currency.
currency. We call them core. Yes, yeah, so all you need to know, save in Bitcoin. Treat Bitcoin as your savings. Stop using these savings accounts at your banks. In fact, remove all your money from the bank as soon as possible and put all that fiat into Bitcoin and save in uh, Bitcoin. Why? Because it's mathematically guaranteed to increase your purchasing power against the dollar, whereas the dollar is mathematically guaranteed to decrease your purchasing power. That's all you need to know. Bitcoin goes up when you save in Bitcoin, right? Your purchasing power goes up. When you save in fiat, your purchasing power goes down down, right? That's why for $100, you can barely get any groceries at the store. 10 years ago, you can get a decent amount of groceries. It's going to continue this way. With $100, you're going to get less and less and less and less to where you can't even buy anything. It's going to happen. It's happening already. F to BS. Don't believe anything Jay Powell, Janet Yellen, and these fraudsters tell you. They don't have inflation under control. They never will. They never have. Inflation is out of control. Why is it out of control? They continue to print money. We're 35 trillion in debt. They're gonna continue to print and print and print and print. That means it's mathematically guaranteed to increase your inflation. Believe nothing they say, verify everything they do. I'm just saying, I know I'm preaching to the choir here, but I gotta gotta say that. That's not much of what I do now. That's pretty much what I do now, right on Golden. You just gotta save in Bitcoin. That's the bigger picture. Don't complicate this. You just save in Bitcoin. Road to 65,000 in minutes. We're only $100 away. Send it. Let's get it.